For those who missed the live action in UFC 255 Figueredo vs Perez, here are the full fight results. In early prelims, Sasha Palatnikov defeats Luis Kos by TKO at 2.27 of round 3. The Hong Kong native Palatnikov made an impressive victory for his UFC debut, after beating the undefeated Kos in their welterweight bout. In the third round, Palatnikov caught his opponent with a huge right hand and forcing a takedown attempt. That attempt came up empty and Palatnikov fired punches with both hands, prompting a stoppage by Tognoni at the 2.27 mark of the third round. With a win, Platnikov moves to 6-2 while Kos falls to 7-1. In the middleweight division, Kyle Da Kos defeats Dustin Stoltzfus by unanimous decision. Da Kos landed some flush ground strikes, stunning Stoltzfus before the two rose to their feet. Not sitting on his lead, Da Kos kept the heat on, fighting hard to the final horn. Alan Jubin successfully returns to the welterweight division, after a tidy victory over Jared Gooden by unanimous decision. Jubin was sharp in the first round, as he landed the better punches and kicks, both to the body and head. A right left from Gooden stunned Jubin in the second round, but Jubin manages to defend himself and come back to his game plan. With 15 seconds left in the final round, Alan Jubin put everything he had into that squeeze trying to finish his opponent, but Gooden hangs up until the buzzer. In another welterweight action, Nicholas Dalby defeats Daniel Rodriguez by unanimous decision. It's a seesaw battle between Dalby and Rodriguez. Dalby took the first round after drew the first blood with a huge right hand that rocks Rodriguez. Dalby slowed down in the second round while Rodriguez keeps on attacking. In the third and final round, the Denmark native regains control and comes out victorious. Antonina Shevchenko defeats Arian Lipsky by TKO at 4.33 of round 2. Lipsky got a huge right hand in early in round 2, but Shevchenko took the fight back to the mat, where she once again dominated. And after a concerted effort to end the bout with her ground strikes, La Pantera got her victory, as a series of unanswered blows brought in referee Chris Tognoni to stop the bout at the 4.33 mark of the second round. With a win, the number 15 ranked Shevchenko moves to 9 and 2 while Lipsky falls to 13 and 6. In middleweight action, Joaquin Buckley defeats Jordan Wright by knockout in round 2. The sensational knockout artist who owns the knockout of the year spinning back kick, once again hit the stage with another brutal knockout win over the undefeated Beverly Hills ninja Jordan Wright. In the second round, Buckley was sharp and determined to score a knockdown when he caught Jordan with a huge right hand. The referee stops the fight at 18 seconds of round 2. With a win, Buckley moves to 12 and 3 while Wright falls to 11 and 1 with one no contest. And in flyweight action, Brandon Marino defeats Brandon Royal by TKO at 4.59 of round 1. The Mexican Assassin's Baby and Brandon Royal put up a wild fight, as they exchange strikes in the opening frame. Marino had Royal's back and he looked for the submission, but Royal got free and fired elbows at his foe, until he could scramble out of trouble, but the worst thing happened, as he dislocated his right shoulder. Marino fired off unanswered blows, until referee Mark Goddard stopped the fight at 4.59 of the opening round. And in light heavyweight action, Paul Craig defeats Maurizio Rua by TKO at 3.36 of round 2, last year the two fighters bout ends up with a draw. But this time, Paul Craig kept the fight out of the judges' hands, as he stopped former light heavyweight champion Maurizio Shogun Rua in the second round. Craig secures a takedown and storms a ground strikes, and after a series of unanswered blows, Rua tapped out, with the official time of her Dean stoppage 336 of round 2. Let's us move into flyweight divisions, Kat Lynch Cajun defeats Cynthia Calvillo by unanimous decision, Cajun was in total control in the first 5 minutes as she kept her opponent on the end of her strikes throughout, keeping the fight precisely in the range she wanted it to be in. In the second round, Chuck Hagen continues to control the action as Calvillo struggled to find an offensive rhythm, and apparently abandoned her grappling attack. In the third, Calvillo briefly looked to lock up with her opponent, but Chuck Hagen shook her off and continued to lead the action to secure it a victory. Another unanimous decision in UFC 255 when Tim Means defeats Mike Perry, Perry got a takedown in the opening minute of the fight, opting to work on the mat. But Means managed to get up and lands some flush shots before the end of the round. Means was in control of the action on the feet in the first half of round 2, but a hard right hand from Perry rocked the Albuquerque native briefly. With the win Means, now moves to 31 and 12 with one no contest while Perry falls to 14 and 7. 
And in the co-main event, Valentina Shevchenko defeats Jennifer Maya by unanimous decision. Shevchenko's combination was sharp as round 4 opened, and in the second minute, it was a takedown putting Maya on her back. Shevchenko took the back briefly in the last 90 seconds, but Maya dodged any trouble, even though she wasn't able to get to her feet before the end of the round. And with the win, Shevchenko now moves to 20 and 3 while the number 3 ranked Maya falls to 18 and 7 with one draw. And finally for the main event, Deepson Figurito defeats Alex Perez by submission, Gilladin Choke, at 157 of round 1. UFC flyweight champion Figueiredo continued to impress fans and improve his game, as the Brazilian successfully defended his title for the first time with an opening round submission of Alex Perez in the UFC 255 main event. The fighters tested each other with thudding kicks in the first round. The fight soon went to the mat, and in a scramble, Figueiredo locked in a guillotine choke, and after a spirited effort by Perez to get free, he was forced to tap out. The official time of the finish was 1.57 of round 1. With a win, Figueiredo moves to 20 and 1 while the number 4 ranked Paris falls to 24 and 6. And that's all for your UFC 255 full results. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.